What is up, risk takers? Welcome to the Kill Beat Strategy. I am Pete. I'm a top player in risk global domination. The daily release on YouTube, do weeknight streams on Twitch. And if you are interested in getting better at the game of risk, I invite you to subscribe to my channels and come along the ride with me. Welcome to another round of Europe. Advanced Progressive Capital! So I'm in the first position playing as Magenta. Okay, well, wow, wow, wow. Okay, so whomever caps in Bavaria has a fulcrum on the entire board. I go first. I want to see that. I want to be next to the fulcrum, I think. We're going to play it. Yeah. So these blizzards are extremely impactful and important. I choose a middle position for vision. Someone is going to earn this, which all cuts to a one point here. Someone is going to earn this, which all cuts to a one point. Sorry, a two point here and here. So there's two basic pockets and then the rest of the board. So if most people fight over the pockets, then I should be in the, the rest of the board. The bigger bonuses to the east. Okay, black. I see black's cap. Show you guys the settings. We're doing your advanced progressive capitals. Uh, Auto 60 expert progressive cards. Fog and Blizzard are on. Portals lines are off. I'm in the first position playing some magenta. In the second position, blue players, Mick Elwe Connor playing as blue. Yeah, that works. That's a good cap for white. Um, we see the black cap, we see white cap. What do we do with our open? I think we, I think we do this. White sees that. Yeah, we got McElwee. Connor playing his blue USA flag. Third position of the red players general Eldritch 18119 from Puerto Rico. In the fourth position is Rompy Stompy from Sweden playing his black. In the fifth position, the green players Logan from USA. And finally, the white players Schlong slapping it Quapa, right down on the table. Also USA flag. What's up, Schlong? Sure hope I don't get fucked. Uh, <laughs> I do the fucking, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so where do we think all the caps are? Who has the bottom pocket? Where does white go? I choose a middle position on purpose for vision specifically. Okay, looks like blue is not actually playing. We're in a bot. Turn one bot out. Okay, we see this far too often. And the red player. Okay. And we try and ascertain which pocket who is in. I think I want to run bottom right. I want to run here. So I don't think anyone's going to be in here. I think this will be a contested spot. There will be some contest here. But I don't think anyone's in bottom right. We'll see. We got enough troops on our cap and we hold a bonus. Green might break. And what does black do? Black, I bet you, adds to the five and goes into Russia. Gets his troops together. It takes Scandi. That works too. What does green do? Does green break me through Greece? Green somewhere in there. 
We see no one in these two territories. Nobody maybe has capped on a locked. Well, this one locks out. That one locks out as well. There's a number of, of territories you could cap on in the bottom pocket to lock it. You don't see green hitting. Two dice. Rolls of 3v1. He does break me just to connect himself. Yes. Green's bottom left. Is there a contest? Is there a contest there? Does someone else want that? Yeah, white takes bottom. White, white takes mid left. They're rolling a capital. No. Okay, they're just taking the pocket. Yeah, we like this for white. We expect this for white. So the fact that I don't have um, a bonus means he he lived that very risky. The fact that I don't have a bonus means um, I can't steal white's capital, which I would absolutely have done. Now, green should probably not fuck with me, right? Green should focus on holding his pocket. Ugh, I only left my, my cap a fucking five, too. Shit. I got aggressive. I got overly aggressive. That might cost me. I might just die. What does blue do? What does that nine do? That's a bot? Hey, Blue already bought and lose all the troops. Great, I'm lucky. Okay. <laughs> I'm lucky. Blue start with uh, six. Okay, Blue, Blue bot still has their capital, wherever it may be. We definitely don't want a bot in Germany. So if white lets me hold, if green lets me hold, I think we take Germany here and lets white finish behind. Okay, so red is contesting black. Red starts with their capital. No, red's also bought. Red lost their capped and, and bought it. So we've lost blue. We've lost red. In a four-player game at best. Me. Rompy Stompy. Logan. And Schlong. Okay, so I figure green is focused on this direction. Right? I didn't break them. If they break me again, I will <laughs> reconsider <laughs> any sort of clemency to this person. Uh, Black has only the plus three of Scandinavia. Black doesn't even have Scandi. Yes. Yes. All right, I see. Oof, Black is an over-attacker. See where everyone is. Okay, green gets 11. So green has this. They should be going this way now. Fuck you! What an asshole! Oh my god. All right. Green is an overextender, too, I can tell. He's really, really pushing his luck. He probably has nothing on his capitals. So, who is left in that pocket? If white is left in that pocket, wow, is he ever attacking? This guy's really, really overattacking. Holy shit. Okay, so white gets 10 troops. If white's in there, they fucking backdoor green. Doesn't look like they are. Okay, they just take France then. Fine. And Germany. That's fine too. I don't contest white. I let white have everything they want. And noob corner. Ho 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 ho. Do we think they have enough troops on their capital is the thing. This feels like a play it's safe turn. Do I want to steal the black cap? Hmm. It just feels like a play at safe turn. All 
I want green to push their luck into me. You do have a set on three, too. There's no reason to not set early if you're in the first position here. Leverage the... Well, maybe there's bots, but... I kind of feel like green's an asshole. If green continues to be an asshole... Okay, blue has Germany or most of Germany. So it, I, I'm pretty incentivized to break that. I think white does that. Well, white probably doesn't need to because they have a single point cap. Hmm. Yeah, the middle position isn't working. That might be all of red. I think green gets a bunch of troops. I don't think they push up off of this position. I think they finish whatever's behind them this turn. Black has nothing. Black has that capital. <clears throat> White's going to be enormous. Green's going to be large. I'm in the middle. Not that big. Green and white don't touch each other. 16. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yeah, he's in the corner. He just took a cap, I think. And white gets 19. Yeah. Good. Good, good, good. Okay, we see white working on a new corner. And then goes into black. It fails. That's good. Let me still have vision up there. Yeah, I still see that. I still see that. He goes into black. Do I help him? Do want Black's capital. Uh, chance to contest green in the bottom. Feel black. Switch to black. Cause green and white to hit each other. Now that, <clears throat> that is a line of play. Switch to black. So what I need to have happen is I need green to be an asshole, who I, which I think he is, and I need white and green to connect. I don't want to be in the middle of the board. I want to be here. I want to get the red kill when the time is right. Expensive. We lose a lot from that play. We lose the bonus we were in. We see the green pocket is now in the middle of the board. Did green, get, did green hold the plus five? Yeah. Okay, so green has... This is probably only... Green's only position. Or green. This is probably blue's only position. It's probably red's only position. So we see where the bots... We don't actually know who's down here. We should investigate that too. But I, I feel a lot more secure with my capital... Um, in the east. Black's now fucked. So now we're in a, we're in a three-player game. What I need to have happen is, I, I'm sure green knows that white is here, and I'm sure white knows that green is here. So I need those guys to hit each other, and I want it to not be in the way of the two stronger players. So this is a calculated retreat play. Green's huge. White's huge. Hopefully they address each other. rather than me. Yeah, now they're just cleaning Orient. Why would you stop hitting if you were green? You wouldn't. You keep hitting. I don't think this man has anything on his capitals, frankly. This indicates to White that, uh, hey, he's enormous, and maybe you should deal with it. White doesn't seem to care to steal the blue cap. They do. They take the blue cap here. 
White is also not okay. White kills black, gets four cards, sets. That's the six trade. I think we have like the red and the blue kill too. We want it. So I'm very high confidence that this is all green now. The, the green's not kill guarding. Um, and there's a little bit of board up here that I can't see that's going to be reds. So this turn we can probably get the red kill. Do we go for that? What's it worth? The eight trade. I don't think it is worth, frankly. One more turn it might be. Let's see what happens if between red and blue, either of them have cards and are a viable kill. White's not addressing green yet. So white and green are still copacetic in their massive pockets. Looks like blue's gonna be on four cards. We have a pretty guaranteed line on the blue kill, unless white beats me to it. Similarly, red sets here or no? Red, red being on five cards means I kill red for sure. Yeah! Okay, here's a cool line of play then. Here's a, okay, no, get a fifth card, get a fifth card, get a fifth card, get a fifth card, get a fifth card. Okay, so. I can kill red set, kill blue set, and then be back in this game. <sighs> Green's going to be an asshole, maybe, and pop one of those caps. He's in. Green's in on white now. He's here. He made it this far. He popped through. Green has three capitals. Okay, so white is weak. Green is ridiculously strong. Blue dies. Huh. Yeah. Gets red too, I think. He didn't kill. He didn't break white. He just killed blue. So that means white's strong. That still will mean that white will have a chance. Guy just loves hitting. <laughs> this guy just loves hitting shit. He finally opens my capital. Does he have the red kill too? He might. That's going to be real bad news, baseball folks. Yep. Well, now it's on white. White has to address it. This guy has the whole board. He's going to go across the top or is he going to retreat? He's going to go across the top. So now he's in, in white. So white has cards, we assume. And let's see what they do. This guy spends his whole turn attacking. So he's got nothing on his capitals. Does he get back to a capital in time? And the answer is no fortify. Okay, so his caps probably have nothing on them. I don't know where the caps are is the problem. Wait, only gets 15. Oh, fuck. He only has 15. What does he start with? Nothing. Yeah. So in order for this game to not be a total sweep by green, white and I need to successfully coordinate. I think the first thing I do is I blind green to... This position, I switch again. And there's white. It's addressing. It's addressing a lot. Do we see any caps switch? Green's is a good game. Shit. Fuck. 
<laughs> no chance. No, I didn't get 10 there. Fuck! Too bad. 36 plus 20. That's game. This kills me. I die. No reason not to. Just kill me, right? No, he's going into white. Do we set? That doesn't kill me. That goes into white. Yeah. Okay. There's a cap there? Cap there up at the top. There's a cap there. One, two, three, four. You want enough troops if you sue my capital. He kills white dead. Okay, we get second. Schlong got fucked. <laughs> and set will have enough to take my capital. That's a good game. Second. Those pockets were wild. And yeah, you know what? Would be great if we had that uh, Blizzard config on an actual six-player game and not a four-player game, but I can't control that. So GG to Logan. Yeah, I don't know what what is up with the disconnects, guys. And I think um, Black played it very poorly. So Black, if you um, if you see this video, because you're actually the highest ranked player in this in this game, if you see this video um, having a having a split bonus there on a on a Blizzard configuration that had that kind of inevitability, you were doomed from the get go. But I think he might have also just been fucked. By bought outs there you have it ladies and gentlemen hope you enjoyed hope you found some of this fun and entertaining maybe even a little bit educational and informative the snowballs do happen the other way if you are interested in getting better the game of risk i invite you to subscribe to my channels come along the ride with me i have a daily release on youtube i'm doing weeknight streams on twitch and for all of you on the path to world domination good games and good luck